Hey guys, Jason here with Quantum Courses, and in this tutorial, we'll be going over how to make a professional logo for your brand or business using Placeit. With Placeit, you can access the easy to use logo maker that allows anyone to create eye-catching logos in seconds. You can select from thousands of graphics and fonts to create a unique design for your brand with no design skills required. The Placeit logo maker allows you to select from a variety of templates to create your own unique brand logo by customizing the fonts, colors, and graphics with just a few clicks. In this video, I'll be demonstrating how to use the Placeit logo maker to make a high quality logo that you can add to your brand pages, website, t-shirts, or anywhere else you want to add your logo. To access the Placeit logo maker and follow along, go ahead and head over to jasongandy.info or simply click the link in the video description. So now that you've logged into Placeit, let's go over the steps to create a logo for your brand. If you look at the top menu, you should see a tab that says Logos. Let's hover our mouse over that now. From the drop down menu, you'll see tons of different categories and subcategories that you can select from to create your logo. They have logo templates available for topics like clothing and apparel, education, food and events, gaming, lifestyle and fitness, music and podcasts, and tons more. As you can see, no matter what niche you're in, Placeit will likely have logo templates available. But for this demonstration, instead of starting with a category, let's start from scratch. To do this, let's just click the main logo tab up top here. This will take you to a page where you can enter your company or your brand name. Adding your brand name here will add your brand name to all of the logo templates that we'll be viewing shortly. This will give you a better idea of how your brand name will look with each template while browsing. So for my example brand name, I think I'll call my company King Apparel. Once you've added your brand name, go ahead and click the next button on the right hand side. This will take you to the next step where you can select the industry that your brand is a part of. If you click the drop down menu here, you can select from dozens of different industries that you can select for your brand. The industry that you select will determine the style of templates that will be displayed for your logo. For my King Apparel Company, I'm going to select Clothing Brand. Once you select your industry, go ahead and click the Let's Go button. This will take you to a page that displays hundreds of logo templates based on the information that you entered. Since I added my brand name, all of the logo templates will feature my King Apparel brand. Also, since I selected clothing brand as my category, the template formats and graphics should resemble a clothing brand logo. Using the menu up top here, you can easily change your brand name, change your category, or choose a graphic to use for all of the templates. But for now, let's just scroll through the search results and check out the various logo templates for my King Apparel brand. As you can see, Placeit has a wide variety of logo templates in various formats. No matter what style of logo you're looking for, Placeit will definitely have a logo template for you. Remember that all of the logo templates are fully customizable so you can change the text, the colors, and even the graphics. So for my example King Apparel brand, I think I'll start with this logo template here. Once you select a logo template, you'll be taken to the Placeit editor. Here's where you can rearrange and fully customize your template with your own text, images, colors, and more. Since we've already added our brand name, it should already be entered in the text field on your template. For this template, there's another text box underneath where I can add a tagline to my logo. So for my King Apparel clothing brand, let's add the tagline as royal as it gets. Once you've added your brand name and your tagline, you can then edit your text font and the colors if you wish. So let's change the font of my brand name and see if we can find something a bit more kingly. To change your font, simply go to the text box on the left and click the font tab underneath. This will open up a drop down menu where you can select from hundreds of fonts that are available on Placeit. You can search through suggested fonts, fonts that you've saved, or search the entire Placeit library for the perfect font for your logo. For my King Apparel brand, I think I'll go with this font here. There we go. Yeah, I think I like that better. To change the color of any of your fonts, simply go to the color icon beside the text box you want to change. You'll then see a box pop up where you can select from any color that you wish under the rainbow. I like to use the colors tab so I can view all the colors and try some different ones out. For my as royal as it gets tagline, I think I'll go with this dark red. Once you've updated your text, your fonts, and your colors, you can then rearrange and resize all the elements on your template. To move your text or your graphics, simply click and drag it to the correct location. 
You can also resize any of the elements by simply clicking and dragging the corners. If you look on the right hand side, you can use the drop down menus up top to change your background color or change the color of your graphic. When selecting your colors, I recommend using your brand colors to keep everything consistent. And if you want to change your graphic, you can easily do that from the menu on the right hand side as well. Simply type in whatever it is you're looking for in the search bar here, and you'll see hundreds of graphics from the Placeit library that you can select from. For my King Apparel brand, let's see what comes up when I search for graphics related to King. As you can see, they have tons of different graphics related to the keyword King, such as many styles of crowns and other royal images. To select a different graphic for your logo, simply click it to add it to your template. For my logo graphic, I think I'll just go with this crown here. For many of the graphics on Placeit, not only can you adjust the graphic color, but also the accent color. The accent color will be the secondary color on your image. Currently, the accent on my crown is white, but I think I'll turn this to a more golden color. So once you've added your text, selected your graphics, and added your colors, go ahead and rearrange everything and get everything exactly the way you want it. Take your time and be creative. You can arrange your text and your graphics any way that you like. If you wanted to change the angle of your graphic or your text, simply go down to the bottom here and click the little circle icon to rotate it. So for my logo, I think I'll put my text on the right hand side of my graphic. This crown graphic is pretty cool, but I think I can find a better one. When creating your logo, feel free to change anything that you need until you get it perfect. So for this example logo, I think this crown here looks a lot better. Whenever you change your graphics, your text, or other elements, you may have to resize and rearrange everything a bit to get it exactly right. So here's my new King Apparel As Royal As It Gets brand logo. I think this is almost ready to roll, but unless you want to have a colored square behind your logo when you download it, we need to remove the colored background. To remove the background, let's look on the right hand side and go to the background drop down menu. From here, we need to click on the colors tab and then we're going to go all the way down to the bottom right and click the little checkered icon here. Your colored background should now be replaced with a checkered pattern symbolizing a transparent background. With a transparent background, not only can you add your logo to your website and brand pages, but also other products such as t-shirts or business cards. So to download our new logo, let's look up at the right hand side and click the download button. Your logo will then start processing and after it finishes, you'll be able to click the link here to download your logo to your computer. So now that I've downloaded my new logo, let's open it up and check it out. And voila! I think this would work great for a clothing brand. I can now use my logo to market my brand online or promote my brand on other products like t-shirts, business cards, or other promotional products. So that's a quick overview of how to easily create a logo using the Placeit Logo Maker. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.